What's up, everybody? It's your boy P from Loud Pack. I hope everybody doing all right this morning. Just hopping back in with another video. Um, man, this is why I won't bet on a fight. You know what I'm saying? I'll make a prediction, which half the time I get those wrong. But I definitely won't put money on it because it's just too many moving parts for me. You know what I'm saying? I mean, it's a mano a mano sport. You know what I mean? So depending on how that fighter feels or what he's went through during fight week or fight night or night before the fight. I mean, fighters have come in sick. All kinds of things on fight night, you know, so you never know how a fighter is going in the ring. You never know about the referee and you never know about the judges. So it's a lot of moving parts. Too many for me to even mess around with putting some money on the table. Like I say, I throw a prediction out there here there. But anyway, man, um, wow. Right now, upset of the year. Dimitri Bivol um, beats Canelo Alvarez. Now, mind you, I ain't the biggest Canelo fan, period. You know, I do respect his skills, but I think he's very arrogant. And I think that, you know, when he pissed dirty that time, that just that took, a t took him down a couple of notches in my book. But I do respect him as a uh, his, his boxing skill, <clears throat> and um, we've seen this look before. Canelo in there with a tall European fighter. We've seen that before. We've seen it several times, and it kind of just was. Most people thought just another outing for Canelo, but this one was different. You know, Dimitri Bivol was different. Canelo started out the fight good, trying to break Bivol down. But then halfway through the fight, <clears throat> Canelo looked like he gassed and Bivol stepped on the gas. You know, Bivol was the faster man. Surprisingly, being bigger, he was the faster man and um, outboxed Canelo, you know, and just pulled away from him in the second half of the fight. Um, of course, Canelo, like I said, he's arrogant. He's a sore loser. You know, the first thing comes out his mouth is he didn't lose the fight. He's hollering about a rematch. Um, honestly, after watching this fight, a rematch, Bivol might do the same thing to him. It might be worse next time around. You know, sometimes fighters just got your number, but definitely much respect to Bivol for, you know, getting that victory over, over Canelo. Um, Canelo was... The number one pound for pound. So, you know, early in the night, Terrence Bud Crawford, you know, made a post and said he's elevated to number one. He was number two, but now he should be number one. Rightfully so. Canelo lost. But I don't know. Y'all hop in the comments. Let me know what y'all think about the fight. Do y'all think a rematch, we would see something different? You know, were y'all shocked by the outcome? You know, I know with some people out there who probably had Bivol you know, winning the fight. I mean, Floyd Mayweather said he put 10K on Bivol, you know, so, I mean, I get it. I respected Bivol. I've seen him fight before, you know, but it's different. I never seen him fight a guy on Canelo's level, you know, a guy with the skill set and just experience of Canelo. So, you know, it would be hard to gauge how they would meet up, but Bivol rose to the occasion and got the victory, so I take my hat off to him, much respect for him, you know, but um, let me know what y'all thought about the fight. Make sure y'all hit the like button, the notification bell, um, share the video. Um, appreciate all my subs, my day ones, all my new ones chiming in. I appreciate them trying to put out more content, trying to um, step up my editing game, <laughs> you know. So, you know, I'm definitely in it to win it. And I'm glad y'all been riding with me. But <clears throat> y'all make sure y'all check me out on IG, Allow Pack Boxing. Check me out on IG. Um, at the Jab Effect, me and my partner over there, Combo Breaker. 
99. We had the Jab podcast going. Hopefully we get that back up and rolling. But that's all I really got, man. Yeah, I'm still kind of processing the Canelo loss, you know, because a lot of people just didn't see this coming. You know, Canelo, a decision over Canelo is, is hard to get. <laughs> you know, we seen fights that we thought that he lost, but he got the decision. Laura, you know what I'm saying? Um, Triple G. So, um, yeah, you know, that was that was big for Dimitri. So um, we'll see what happens next, man. We'll see what's next for Canelo. We'll see what's next for Dimitri Bivol. Um, and that's it, man. That's all I really got. Y'all enjoy the rest of y'all weekend. It's your boy P, Lyle Pack, and I'm out.